Yasmin Levy. I'm from Israel, Jerusalem. I'm a singer, uh, singing Ladino and Spanish. Ladino is a language, uh, Jewish Spanish, of the Jews that lived in Spain. And they lived in Spain till 1492, and they were expelled from Spain this year, and they were dispersed to, dispersed to many uh, parts of the world, mainly to the Balkan, to the Ottoman Empire, and to North Africa. And the Spanish they spoke in Spain got mixed with different languages, depending on the country the, the Jews went to live in. And this mixture is the, the language. It's mainly Spanish mixed with different languages. Sendero, pero es andador. No te conformes nunca con seguir pensando. ¿Qué es el amor? Pregúntale al jilguero, el brillo y a la flor. No tiene sendero, pero es andador. No necesita puertas en el camino. Gracias. Thank you very much, all of you. Ole. <laughs> Thank you very much. You know, the Sephardi songs, the Jewish Spanish song, songs, they were all passed down orally from generation to generation. No one ever wrote them down. The mother, she used to clean, to cook, to make a rhythm on a pot and to sing. The same happened in my house. My mom used to cook to make a rhythm on a pot and to sing for me. And that's how I know those songs. 
I would like to sing a Sephardi song, very old one, traditional. It is called Mi Suegra La Negra. My mean mother-in-law. <laughs> this woman is so strong. She is stronger than death itself. I sat one day with my dear husband and we had a nice conversation and suddenly I felt pain in my arm. I felt mm. So I ignored and then I felt ah. So I turned and I saw my mother-in-law. But you know, I'm a happy person and I hope that very soon she will die. <laughs> and I'll have my husband for myself. <laughs> and I dedicate this song to all the mothers-in-law <laughs> that are sitting here, especially for you, mi suegra la negra. My father, Isaac Levy, he was a composer, a musician. As a musician, he went all his life uh, from one Sephardi family to another, and he re recorded people who had songs from this tradition, and then he wrote down the lyrics and the melody. And he passed away when I was one year old, but before he passed away, he, 
He managed to publish four books of romance and religious songs and another ten books of liturgic songs from this tradition. And the people he recorded, they passed away, so that's how he saved those songs, because they could disappear with the people.
Thank you so much. Muchas gracias. Toda raba. I have musicians. First of all, they come from many parts of the world. So everybody, everyone, if he wants or if he doesn't want, he bring his own tradition, and you can hear it in the uh, in the performance. I have flamenco instruments, cajon and guitar, because that's what I did in the second album. And I have oriental instruments like darbuka, uh, santur, and uh, flute from Armenia. And this mixture, what gives more and more uh, flavors to this ancient and beautiful music.
תודה רבה. Thank you very much. Una hora en la ventana. This is a funny song that I usually I imagine that we are in Turkey when we sing this one. And we are like of drunk when we sing this one. He says, uh, it says, you are sitting on the balcony for one hour, and one hour and a half. And I want to touch you. I want to make love to you, but I cannot reach you because your sister, the snake, is watching you. <laughs> so, and then he says, what did your mother eat when she was pregnant with you, that you are so beautiful and you have a dark hair and dark skin and you make my life so hard. You play with my feelings, but don't be so arrogant. There are more beautiful women in this world. You love her and I love her. Let's fight. The one who kills the other wins the woman, this particular woman. Funny song, this one. <laughs> 